I'm glad you asked that question because sometimes it's really important to restate the obvious and we don't talk a lot about why it's important to have critical thinking in our classrooms or to exhibit critical thinking as an individual. But there are many advantages and for one, we're less likely to be manipulated in life and we're more likely to take charge for our decisions and base those on evidence if we're able to weigh evidence critically in our mind. Uh, the University of Manchester has a list of the characteristics of critical thinkers, saying that they are honest with themselves, they resist manipulation, overcome confusion, ask questions, base judgments on evidence, and look for connections among topics and subjects, and they are intellectually independent. These are all great qualities to have in a democracy, and the United States of America, of course, is a democracy, and so these are some important skills that we want to instill in our citizens, the ability to think independently for yourself. So critical thinking is very important in our classroom. So when you hear me talk about thinking critically and asking you to go further, asking you to elaborate on who, what, why, when, where, and how about a particular topic, that's the reason why critical thinking is important to you as an individual in this classroom and as a citizen.